Hello, this is Maths with Lemon, and uh, in this topic we will see the angles of uh, elevation and depression. Engineers can use uh, trigonometry to calculate the height of things like trees and buildings. Uh, the chimney, this chimney needs to be demolished. The engineers need to know how tall it is. They stand 100 meters from the chimney. Using a piece of equipment called a theodolite, they measure the angle of elevation. The angle of elevation is 32 degrees. How they can calculate the height? Now, one method to calculate the height would be to produce a scale drawing. Use a scale 1 cm for 10 meters. The engineers are 100 meters from a chimney, and the angle of elevation is 32. I draw a line of 10 centimeters long. I draw the angle of 32 degrees. I'll join uh, up the height, measure the height. You should find it 6.3 centimeters. A more accurate way to find the height is to use trigonometry. Now, let's see that. Which sides are involved here? Obviously, I have the opposite, and here I have the adjacent. We know the opposite and the adjacent. H is opposite and 100 is the adjacent. Which function do we need to use now? Remember, so ka so basically I have to use obviously tangent we will use a tangent so tangent of angle A which is 32 opposite over adjacent so I can find my height which is 62.5 meters um, let's see that Harry is standing on the edge of a cliff. He sees a boat. He wants to find out how far away the boat is. He knows that the cliff is 40 meters high. He measures the angle of depression. Since the object is lower than the horizon, it's called angle of depression. The angle of depression is 25 degrees. How he can work out the distance from the boat. Uh, this is basic trigonometry. We can use trigonometry to find the distance accurately. The angle of depression is 25. How much is the angle A here now? Because this angle, these two angles are alternate angles on the parallel lines, the horizon and the uh, bottom. Uh, are parallel, so A is also 25 degrees. Now we have all the required information to find the distance D, which is obviously again will be the opposite. I know the opposite side, and I'm searching for the adjacent. I will, again, I will use tangent. So the tangent A, tangent of 25 is 40 over D, so D is. 85 meters point eight. Are there any tall buildings or trees near your school? Is your classroom above ground level? Make your own theodolite to measure angles of elevation and depression. You, know, you just need to use a card, a piece of card, cut like this, some string with a weight uh, on one end and a sheet of paper. You will make a hole there on the um, paper. So basically on the paper you just uh, write all the angles. We have elevation and depression. Line up with the top of the building or the tree and you can find the angle of depression or elevation.